Welcome. Welcome to my new commute route. I have moved and I no longer have my super awesome commute, work commute that I had before, which was uh, just under 11 kilometers. Tons of fun. But my new work commute is about half the distance. But it's still actually a lot of fun. And I have actually two options. One that's essentially all pavement, and one that throws in a little bit of dirt roads. So I'm scoping out the dirt road commute here. Got about two kilometers of uh, pavement until we hit the uh, gravel section. And the cool thing about both routes is that they can essentially both be ridden as time trials because there's almost no reason to stop save for this stop sign here It'll just be kind of a scouting report because my legs are toast from yesterday so it certainly won't be a high speed attempt although we do have a strong tailwind right now so that'll make it fun merging here because cars always seem to think they have the right of way over you. So we're going to hang it right here. That corner should be sweeped once the city sweepers get out but that won't be for a few weeks yet. in the urban industrial section here of the city. So lots of businesses. Here's where we'll cut on the dirt. It's cool. And we are on the wrong side of the tracks, so to speak. So the other route actually just skirts the other side of these tracks. It's going to be fun to do fast. couple old abandoned grain elevators. A little piece of trivia about where I live. It used to be the third largest grain port in the world. So all the grain coming from Saskatchewan, Alberta, southern Manitoba, heading uh, east, came through our city here. 
into these grain elevators. Lots of them are now defunct and uh, no longer in operation. They're pretty cool buildings. They're pretty cool to go explore. Although uh, people have died in these buildings, exploring them and falling into those uh, storage units there. Very cool and creepy. the geese. Oh yeah, I'll be able to hammer hammer this. This will be a good hard workout. 10-15 minute uh, prologue, Tour de France type prologue of just wrenching intensity. The whole distance is only around five or six kilometers. Seagulls. Seasonably warm. Daytime highs have been in the uh, 10 to 20 Celsius range, but today it's gone back to normal. I think it's two degrees above freezing right now. Our toast. That little rise we went up over there, uh, I feel the burn in my legs. Okay, we're gonna have a problem here with this train. It's gonna block our route. Very shortly, because we need to cross the tracks over there. It looks like a long train. Although currently we 
we are going faster than it is, but it's going to reach the crossing over there before we will. equals slow. section where I could pick up the pace, give a final push. Not now, but when I'm actually in shape enough to attack this route. flurry to the back door at work. Very flourish. Bang. So I'm guessing that's uh, six, seven kilometers, maybe a little bit less than that. So that's actually going to be tons of fun. Um, I'm going to go for a second ride tonight and I'll do a scouting of uh, the paved version. And uh, hopefully I'll post both of those tonight.